bozos, Spencer23 here, just a very quick video for you today. I've been making quite a few videos running through your suggestions on the attacks you'd like to see, but this next one I thought was possible to do first time around. Suggestion by Stevie C, can you replace the golems with giants? So there's a very good reason for doing that, if you compare the stats side by side, replacing a golem with six giants, the same housing space, the hit points are not so far away from each other, so they'll probably still work as meat shields. However the training time, you're going to be able to stay online and cook these and do your attack right away. Damage per second, they're only meat shields we're not too worried about. The actual cost in Elixir is listed right here, however, if you were to gem the resources, it would cost 35 gems for a golem and only 6 for all 6 of your giants. So if you lower down the rankings, this is definitely a strategy to try. So I decided to give this one a go. It's my first attempt, so I'm not so practiced at it, but I've done the best that I can. Try to give you an idea of what you should do if you're planning on doing something like this. It's only taken me three spins I believe on this to, to find the first base that's worth a go and here it is we like the look of this one two wizard towers down at the bottom which are going to play no part in our attack whatsoever now I've changed to replay version here because I would, you would seriously be sick trying to watch it as I played it I was all over the screen kind of panicking a little bit I wanted to make sure I did this right so I want to take out the two wizard towers as usual, put down my two giant meat shields which don't last very long at all as you can see. So then I've got to put down another two on either side. My first mistake, I've not put one in front of each of these archer towers which is what I should have done. It means the queen is taking some serious damage, we need her alive for that mortar. Gonna have to use her special ability, keep her invisible. There she goes and we should get this mortar down just in time so we can start releasing some troops. I've started kind of plonking giants down, realizing that I still have some left, so definitely this strategy could work with a bit of practice. Lightning on the clan troops a little bit too early, but I think we're probably going to be able to get through this wall with some giants still alive. The witches are down now. Out comes the archers, no lightning left to kill those, but hopefully the skeletons will keep them occupied while our archers deal with them straight away. Here comes some more skeleton defenders. With this kind of attack, we don't have to worry about those. Here comes our snake of archers, heading towards the town hall. Giants have set off the big bombs. Our archers have split in two. It's not really ideal when they do that. It takes them a little bit longer to cut through walls. I, said, I think they've probably done that because they are following giants a little bit. So here we go, we've got to the inner sanctum, We're trying to get now to the town hall. It takes a little while to get rid of the dark because our archers are split in half. Melted through the wall, get rid of the clan castle, and here we go. King comes out, he has absolutely no chance against all of these archers. Get that inferno down and we're on to the town hall. Here comes the money shot, town hall down. That's what we'd like to see. Will we get both stars? Well. It's kind of lucky on this occasion, we probably could have done a slightly better effort at this, but with a bit of practice, I think we can definitely achieve some good results, and a very cheap army to boot. There we go, the two stars, 50% dead on. So thank you guys for all of your suggestions, please keep them coming, I am practicing some of these other attacks. Goblins, what are you guys on? I've been littered with some gala fails and I've lost a few cups so far trying to get them right but some of them are quite interesting to see. I'll have these videos ready for you very soon. Until then, full attack! <laughs>